Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can add drawing markups that remain visible on a PDF page at all times, even when the comments list panel is displayed. With the exception of the Add Text box and Add Text Callout Drawing Markups, the other drawing markups are simple shapes that do not contain text comments by default. However, you can easily add a text comment to any drawing markup if desired. To show the drawing markup tools, click the Drawing Markups panel within the Comment pane in the Task pane. To add a text box drawing markup, click the Add Text Box tool within the Drawing Markups panel. You can then either click once to insert a text box, or click and drag to define an area for the text box within the PDF page. Then type the text you want the text box to contain. Once your text is added to the text box, the box remains visible. You can then click the border of the text box to set the text display and select the text box. You can click into the PDF page to deselect the text box. To edit the text again if needed, double click directly on the text within the text box to place your insertion marker into the text so you can make your editing changes. Then click the border again to set the text and select the box, or click into the PDF to set the text and deselect the text box. Note that you can resize and move a text box within the PDF using the same techniques shown for many other objects in Acrobat. So you can click and drag the border of the text box to move it as well as click and drag the resizing handles on the border of a selected text box to resize it. You will find that you can use these same techniques to move and resize all of the drawing markup shapes shown in this lesson. To delete a drawing markup, click its border to select it, and then press the delete key on your keyboard, or right click the drawing markup, and then choose the delete command in the pop-up menu that appears. The add text callout tool will draw a text box with an attached arrow that points to something in the PDF page. To add a text callout, click the add text callout tool in the drawing markups panel. The pointer turns into a crosshair tool at that point. Click in the PDF page at the spot that the arrow will point to and then either drag to position the text box or click once again at another location to position the text box. Now once the text box has been placed, you can immediately type the text to add to the drawing markup. You can then manipulate the text callout just as you did a text box. However, when the text callout is selected, note that you can use the resizing handle at the end of the arrow to also reposition it within the page if needed. Now the other drawing markup tools allow you to add shapes to PDF documents. When you hold your mouse pointer over any of these tools, you will see a small screen tip that shows the name of the tool and how to draw it. You can use the Draw Freeform tool to draw freeform images within a PDF. The Erase Freeform tool can be used to remove mistakes from freeform drawings.
Note that to flip an arrow that you have drawn when using the Draw Arrow Drawing Markup tool, you can simply right click the arrow and then select the Flip Line command in the pop-up menu to flip the arrow pointer to the other end. You can also right click a drawing markup in the PDF and then choose the Properties command in the pop-up menu that appears to open the Properties dialog box for the selected shape. You can change the appearance of the shape by clicking the Appearance tab and then changing the settings shown to adjust settings such as the style, color, opacity, thickness, and fill color. Note that the exact properties available will change depending on the shape selected. Make any changes you want to apply on this tab and then click the OK button. To add a text pop-up note to any drawing markup, right-click the markup to which you want to add text, and then select the Open Pop-up Note command in the pop-up menu that appears. A small pop-up window will then appear just like the ones associated with the other text annotations. Type the text you want to associate with the drawing markup into the pop-up note and then click into the PDF to set the pop-up note. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.